all right so welcome back to episode three of day in the car you guys are gonna love this diet today i've changed it up once again as you can tell my voice is a little bit messed up i have got a bit of a cold but nevertheless we're still gonna stay consistent and stay cutting but yeah just woke up on half an hour to an hour ago and now we're gonna go and have some breakfast Okay, so today the goal is 2,300 calories for the entire day. So breakfast is officially complete. There is one thing missing. I don't know if you've noticed, but we're having three garlic bread instead of four today. That's because I wanted to save some calories to have this new coffee recipe that I came up with. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to make it. Honestly, it's one of those things you either like or you don't. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to make it. We're gonna be using some dark chocolate, calorie-free sweetener, so literally zero calories, some coffee, caffeinated coffee, just to, you know, wake you up a bit as well as we are still having breakfast. And we're gonna be using 200 ml of milk. So this, in total, will have around 180 calories, but honestly, it will taste like it has 300 to 400 calories. It's incredible. So this is our breakfast fully complete. Whole thing has around this much calories exactly, this much grams of protein. Gonna go down this now and then get ready to go to the gym. So we're on our way to the gym right now to hit some chest and triceps. I've got a zero sugar apple flavored monster. This is like my favorite monster. This tastes so good. And obviously I'm using this for the caffeine to get that pump. Gonna show you guys my drop set method today because honestly this drop set method, you have to try this. It's incredible. A lot of you guys that I'm coaching have loved this drop set method. And I'm going to show you guys on YouTube exactly how to perform it. All right, so I'll see you at the gym. So now I'm going to show you the drop set that will literally change the way you train triceps or any other thing to be honest. What we're going to do is we're going to start off with 10 reps, rest for 30 seconds, lower to 8 reps, rest for 30 seconds again, and lower to 6 reps, rest for 30 seconds again, 4 reps, and then rest for 45 seconds and do your last 10 reps. Making sure the weight is the same across the entire drop set. If you can, try rest for a shorter amount of time, but if you can't, then 30 seconds is fine.
say if you remember from episode one of this series, you'll remember that I had abs and zero abs. And now we're starting to get some definition into the abs, which is just incredible to see because if you've been following me for a while, you know how fat I used to be. Like I'll put a picture of him right now. So just seeing like me get this far in terms of like finally being able to see my abs is just an incredible feeling. If you're on this journey with me, honestly, it's gonna be worth it. Keep grinding, it's definitely gonna be worth it. Like this feeling, it's so surreal. Just got home from the gym and now we're gonna have a little post-workout snack. So what I'll be having is 150 grams of chicken breast alongside some mozzarella cheese. And obviously we'll be having our sauces with this as well. We have the 50% less sugar, tomato ketchup, and of course some light mayonnaise. This totals up to around 351 calories. What I'll also be having with this is a protein pudding, a caramel flavored protein pudding with 20 grams of protein, bringing our total macros, 511 calories and 69 grams of protein. All right, so I'm gonna go eat this and then edit for a bit and then have our final meal of the day. Final meal of the day, we have exactly 200 grams of white boiled rice, 200 grams of chicken breast, seasoned absolutely beautifully, extra hot chili sauce. Added one fish in there. You guys might think I'm weird for doing that, but it tastes really good and it just makes it easier to eat this and more enjoyable. So yeah, this entire meal consists of exactly this much calories and this much protein. I'm gonna go eat this now and then we only have a few calories left, which I'm gonna have just before I go to bed. Probably gonna be some sort of protein sauce or something, but yeah. <sighs> Last meal of the day. I wouldn't even consider this meal more of like a late night snack. So what I have is my anabolic protein cereal. I've made an entire video on how to make this. I will link it right here so you can go check it out. It's very, very low in calories, very high in protein if you make it right. But I don't have a lot of calories left, which is why I've only made a small amount of this. Normally I have 100 grams of this for breakfast. But yeah, this has around 200 calories and around 12 grams of protein, which is not a lot of protein, but I've already hit my protein for today. So I don't necessarily have to have a lot of protein in this. That brings us to the end of the video. The final macros are on here right now. This has been the full day of eating at around 2,300 calories. An incredible diet for you to follow if you are trying to cut down. But yeah, thank you very much for tuning in. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video.